Top 5 rounds for MCPE 1.19 Starting off with the Dark SMP When you load into this realm, you will immediately spawn in this hub right over here And it's actually going to give you a bunch of starter loot over here and a bunch of kits as well And essentially, this is actually a, you know, pretty basic survival SMP At the very start, there's actually like a little village over here that you guys can go ahead and stay at And get a temporary starter base All you have to do in order to go to the wilderness is go right behind this uh, blow terracotta line Keep in mind that PvP is actually turned on in this realm, so you can actually full-on pvp battles over here next up we have the shadow kit pvp realm in order to get started make sure to go to the gear icon over here and just press on it and then you'll see this entire menu will pop up right over here there's pvp parkour anything you could think of this realm actually does have it which is so sick in my opinion we have all the information about the server how much money you have your kill streak your kill to death ratio the cooldown and you can even spectate duels as well for example we're literally up here in this arena and we can see everything that's going on inside and there's also ffa arenas as well so you can get your combos in if you want as you can tell we literally are just pvping this kid right over here there's also a shop over here in case you want to get better kits and stuff like that so next up we have the apocalypse arc realm believe it or not this is a realm dedicated to all about zombies essentially you are taken to a city over here and at nighttime the zombies will spawn in essentially what you got to do is you got to kill as many zombies and you can actually go ahead and trade their flesh in order to get certain items and stuff like that but oh my goodness we already found some zombies over here as you can tell there is a lot of zombies and sometimes you just have to run away from all the zombies over here but these zombies have like this really cool animation to it and they're actually made to be enhanced meaning that they actually go a little bit faster than the vanilla minecraft there are so many different buildings for you to hide and stuff like that and over here is the flesh trader and this is basically the building that you can use in order to get items such as weapons by using the flesh over here which is definitely pretty cool next up we have the elite anarchy realm this is the realm that's sort of meant to be like the 2v2t version for my Minecraft Bedrock Edition, which is super duper sick. Everything is just completely destroyed. So it may be a struggle in order for you to find like your first house and stuff like that, or even to just find a tree. This is just like a survival realm or a anarchy realm where you can basically do whatever you want. There is little to no limitations. You can go ahead and construct anywhere, wherever you want. It's definitely very unique to see all the different projects that you can find. And look at this. There's just a bunch of netherite blocks sitting here, along with some shulkers over here. So next up, we have the Sir Pokemon realm. This realm literally adds smp with pixel mom right off the bat you'll notice that we have this really cool pokemon village over here with full-on poke centers everywhere and here's a full-on pokeball over here as you can tell they do work this guy just went ahead and captured a pokemon so ggs to that guy over here and look guys we have another pokemon over here a rattata and these pokemon are actually hostile so they might actually attack you so be aware of that but look at that boys they have custom particles you can find all sorts of pokemon in this realm some being more rare than others so make sure to keep that in mind and you can actually go ahead and hit these pokemon in case you want them to run at you but as you can tell these guys are actually really powerful and they even do have health bars as well see you later french fry